You saw the employment report release this morning, a loss of 84,000 jobs and an increase in the unemployment rate to 6.1 percent. Uh, there's no question that the labor market is not as strong as we'd like, and these were disappointing numbers. Uh, we want to see the economy return to job growth, and we understand for Americans also to know that in, uh, in addition to these numbers, there are other numbers that show that the economy is starting to show some signs of uh, growth. For example, the growth rate uh, from last week and also on productivity and exports. Those numbers have been positive, which show that our economy is qu quite resilient. Yeah. David, you painted a fairly upbeat picture of the economy despite the job losses, and yet, yet most economists say that the, the, the kinds of job losses that were reported today tend to be the kind we see in the early stages of a recession. Uh, what would it take for the president and the administration to begin considering a second stimulus package? We, uh, I, I, we've gone through the recession thing before. I think I just told you that the last two quarters um, showed growth, and, uh, and there's plenty of economists out there, and they have. They're very, I'm sure they're very intelligent. They have a lot of resources at their fingertips, but I just haven't talk, heard anybody talking necessarily about a, a recession. Uh, the economic stimulus. You pointed out one of the positive numbers that you're pointing to is the uh, growth rate for the last quarter, but uh, it's widely accepted by a lot of economists that it was the economic stimulus checks that went out that was responsible for that. I mean, isn't that maybe pointing to an artificially inflated number to say there are some strong areas of the economy? No, that was precisely the reason that we did the economic stimulus package, is so that we could get our country back on a footing of growth, um, so that it could help uh, get us through an economic downturn. So that's exactly why we did it, and it's having the intended impact. Uh, the job growth has not caught up to that, though, and uh, we hope to see that towards the end of the year. If that was what. I'm sorry. One more question okay. on um, those economic um, growth numbers or the job yeah. loss numbers. Um, you did point to productivity being mm -hmm. higher, but isn't that a two-edged sword in that sometimes you accomplish higher productivity by needing less workers to do more work? You know what, Paul, as I said, when it comes to economics, um, what I can do is point you to the numbers, which is that productivity was at 3.4 percent, which was um, considered a, a good number by the economists uh, that look at this uh, from our perspective. And